Desiree Neal, huge congratulations. I like the discussion as you approach me. Should we bring the trophies? Which mic belongs to who? And you decided the smaller one belongs to you. So Desiree, we'll start with you because after everything that you have won over the last 12 months, I think you're going to need a bigger Grand Slam trophy cabinet. <laughs> congratulations. Thank you so much. <laughs> You look stunned. Sorry, I did not hear you. You look stunned. I mean, it's, yeah, I am, I'm speechless. So, uh, yeah, it's, it was just, I don't even know what to say. I really don't know. But I mean, thank you to everyone that came out. This has been such a special moment. Neil, thanks for playing again. Two in a row, baby. At Wimbledon. <laughs> and Neil, we had a very similar conversation this time last year about what this means to you, but to come out here and do it all over again with Desiree, how special a moment is this for you in your career? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's incredible. Um, it's especially nice that my, uh, my parents are here this year. They, they weren't able to come last year, um, so it's nice to play in front of, it, in, in front of them um, and to Des for playing me with this year. Um, <laughs> I, uh, I got a, a late minute um, call from Des to play. We weren't meant to play, um, so it's only been a team for the last two weeks. Um, but yeah, we'll have to go for three next year, if she plays with me. Jeez, put me on the spot. <laughs> it's not easy to win this once. To be able to do it back to back is hugely impressive. It's not been done since 96, 97, but for both of your knowledge, that the last British man to get back-to-back -back mixed doubles titles was John Lloyd. The last American lady was Billie Jean King. So you're in very, very good company. <laughs> <laughs> but to do this together, to do this together is hugely, hugely special. Just try and, and give us a, a feeling of the emotions to be able to do this back-to-back. -back. Did you really believe once you'd eventually made the phone call to Neil again, did you really believe it could happen? Yeah, I mean, I think you kind of just have to go out there and just play every match. Every match is so tough. And, you know, I think we just stuck it in and just, you know, went match by match and just uh, here we are. So. And Neil, just a, a word on your opponents tonight. I mean, I don't think there's probably anyone on the face of this earth who's played more tennis in the last four days than Matt. They've put up a, a, a brave, brave fight. <laughs> He's still in it. He's still in it. He's still got more to come. Yeah, unbelievable uh, couple of weeks by them too. Uh, Matt, I got revenge today. He beat me in the men's doubles <laughs> in five sets uh, last week. But uh, good luck. It's been an amazing two weeks for you, you and uh, uh, Max Purcell. Um, I don't know how you're still standing. You played about 700 five set matches. Um, <laughs> but good luck in the final. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think we've all seen something very special tonight. Put your hands together one final time for our Wimbledon mixed doubles champions, Desiree Trautek and Neil Scott. Thank you.